a nice quick short video for basic or intermediate levels doesn't matter um, and it's about moving and copying so people quick ways of doing it so you can duplicate within a sheet move within a sheet to another workbook um, a new one and also between existing uh, workbooks so it's quite a good exercise nice and quick hope you enjoy if you need it so let's just run over it so you've got move if you grab a sheet you can move it and you can see the sheet itself my cursor is flashing at the moment and you can see the little black down arrow so moving is quite easy you can also move if you right click and use the feature move and copy and you can move within a sheet so if you wanted to move it to the end you could do that if however you want to copy it to the same sheet somewhere else you need to make sure that you remember to click on the create a copy if you don't want to move it within that workbook amongst those sheets you may want to move it to a new workbook so that way you would drop down if I'm going to copy it in this case not move it I'm a copy and I'm going to go to a new workbook and then if I OK you'll see on screen that I get this brand new workbook book one and I have the north copy in there Go back to the other one and the north is still there so i did create a copy which is the way i should have done it if i wanted to do duplicate a sheet i can grab it and hold the control key and drag and drop and you can see that it's a useful thing because it will continue to do the same sheet same worksheet and it will give it a, a different number because obviously worksheets cannot have the same name but that way if you had um uh, bookkeeping or something or monthly income that you need to look at you can carry on using exactly the same data and then just change the data in those areas and then you could highlight those three that one and that and you could delete using the shift key or one by one doesn't really matter okay so we've looked at the move and copy within the sheet we've looked at the move or copy to another workbook what if you wanted to do another workbook that existing workbook so let's just go back to our um, folder let's open up pay special just so we've got the two workbooks open so when i go back to the um the original move or copy if I now right click move or copy and I creating a copy this time and I've got to go to the pay special workbook it is now available so both workbooks need to be open in order for you to switch between one and the other so now you have the option of the book that we created with the one worksheet north which we haven't named We've got the other workbook, the existing workbook that's open, and we've got a new workbook. So it will really depend on if you have another workbook open, whether you can move or copy that sheet into that workbook. So don't want to patronise anyone, but it's really important that you get that clearly in your head for the exam. For some reason in the exam, people get a little bit disorientated with simulation, and sometimes they move it from the wrong one to to the wrong one okay so just be aware of it okay I'm going to close that not save um, close our pay special and I'm going to next in the next of the series we're going to look at protection and we're going to look at uh, full work protection so I'm going to leave that with you now and um, open that next Is that really a record?